Welcome back to Interviewing Hollywood. We're here with one of the other cast members of the Tuskegee. It's not called the Tuskegee Airmen, it's though, right? The Black Angels over Tuskegee. Did we get? Yeah, absolutely. It's the exact same thing. Yeah. Well, <laughs> what role do you play? I play Percival Nash and also play Elijah Sands. Elijah oh. Sands also played by my good friend Jay Jones. Okay, so which one are you? Are you are you backing up one and doing the other? Yeah, I, I've actually played both, but right now I'm mainly playing Percival Nash. Okay, yeah, all and right. I, and, I, and I understudy, I guess, if you will, uh, Elijah Sands. So, so I, heard, I heard you guys had a wonderful experience when you played for the actual, the living members of the, of the Airmen. We played for literally, I think we played for almost 20 or 25 of, of the actual Tuskegee Airmen. I mean, they come in there with their red jackets. Wow. You know, I mean... These guys are still soldiers. In fact, we were in North Carolina at the National Black Theater Festival, mm -hmm. and they, I mean, I feel like we literally got our wings. Wow. The, the, the airmen sat right up front on the front row at the end of the show. They stood up, and there was, there was one airman I will never forget. He, he had his walker. Bless his heart, he had his walker. And they, and, and they said, a tin hut. My brother got up, straightened what? that back up. Put that hand, right hand, of course. Well, look at you. And saluted us, man. It was, it was so. This this whole process has been just tremendously. Um, it is it, we've added so much wealth and value to to this story. Sure, sure. Um, that that already was tremendously wealthy in terms of in terms of its value. Look, a lot of wow, a lot of questions. You are just so so. That was amazing, and Tom confirmed that. So absolutely, that happens. Yeah. I didn't believe Tom. Tom. Is great. <laughs> He's a real articulate and thoughtful brother. So right. Oh, okay. You, okay. See, he tried to that. interview I'll, me. I'll for him. Okay. We all won. Okay. When you brought up that right hand, though, I, I saw a little bit of the character coming out. I was like, are we in the me? Well, what? I mean, we, tell us we about your background. We workshop the play. I mean, I had a yeah. little bit of experience, you know. I mm -hmm. traveled to Carnegie Mellon, Howard University, all these. Oh, I went to Howard. What year did you graduate? Uh, I actually studied there. I graduated from Carnegie Mellon. I studied okay. there for two for two semesters. Okay. And the Henriette Edmonds, bless you, Henriette Edmonds. You, you were in theater, school. right? I did theater. Okay. Yes, and I also studied under Holly Garima and did the film school down in the school of okay, Well, that's good. So you're, so, yeah. I, so I we, know we, you know we, how to. We bison. That's right. You know, kind of you know, sort of your bison. You know. Sort of. Hey, I grew up on Gerard Street. This is like you know, you know, Carnegie Mellon. I sound like Carnegie Mellon. He sound like you sound, I sound, yeah, I sound like a you, you sound like a tarzan. you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but no, you know, it's interesting because I can tell someone who's been trained, you know what I'm saying, mm. as opposed to um, a character, people who don't understand how to characterize and such. I mean, you, I didn't, haven't even seen you read a line. Mm. When you were lifting, the, the characterization you gave of the, of the airman was amazing. Well, to God be the glory, man. I'm going to tell you, like, like I was told, I'm always going to be a student of this game. Because the moment I feel like, or begin to even think that I have it figured out, mm. I've already lost. So mm. I, that's duly noted. I appreciate that. But I'm, I'm a student of the game, and, and I'm coming. You right. know what I mean? I'm, well, I'm a come threat. Come on down. I'm a threat. Come on down. <laughs> not a threat. He's coming to share his amazing talent with us. This Bless. is not threatening. This is amazing. This is his contribution to the collective. It's not at all threatening. It no. is welcome. 110% strong. Come strong. Come hard. But mm. it is welcome. And you, you know that's what life's about. It's about Indeed. giving. You, you, how old are you? I'm Wow, let me say. Oh no, he looks like he's 24. I'll go with that. <laughs> Tom did the same that. thing. I I'll love go it. With that. He's actors. I love yeah, it. Man. You're doing a great it's job. A bless Thank you, man. you so much. Oh, my pleasure. It was my pleasure having you on. Man. Congratulations, man. You're running a great show, my brother. Well, well, you know, I'm trying. Hey, I'm man. sweating and all kinds of stuff. But you know, it's, it, it's our first time being here at the NAACP Awards, and we're just so glad that, that everyone's welcoming us. Mm -hmm. And and I'm meeting people who are just, you know, it must feel wonderful to, to be to be lauded by your by your peers. Yeah. But but you're doing a lot of hard work and you're sharing with the, with the world. And that's that's it's it's amazing. That's it's amazing. It, I mean, to People are glory, dude. That's that's what that's what we that's what we do as artists. I was Google Santiago always said, Demetrius, when you when you totally become a character, you have an opportunity to be a revolutionary. Sure, sure. You know, when when you when I when when I when I lose Demetrius Gross and I am personal Nash or I am Elijah Sams, mm -hmm. then I'm able to begin to tap and scratch the surface of being a revolutionary and telling a story yeah. that can actually shape and, and cultivate a, a younger person's mind or an older that's, person's mind. That's spoken like a real actor who's really got it into it. I like that. That's why we need to see more of that. So what's next for you real quick? Uh, I have three films coming out in December. Three films? Uh, I haven't got one yet. <laughs> We're we're doing we're doing the Tuskegee Airmen, um, the Black Angels of the Tuskegee, mm -hmm. on the 26th of September in California at the mm -hmm. uh, African American History Museum. But mm -hmm. I have a Quiet Fire coming out, uh, mm -hmm. Division 123. Keep and, going. Um, 
uh, Effie Brown's um, my, yeah. my Place in the Horror with uh, the great Keith David. So, wow, fantastic. Yeah, so some things that wow, happen. Wow, I'm hot with the stars. Thing. You go, good. boy. You, you know go. Saying? Fantastic. Yeah, man. Man, thank you so much for being thank on the show. Thank you for having me. Thank it's you awesome. so much. And thank you for what you deposited to me, bro. Oh, man. Keep, you, keep it on. You know, I'm an old one, so, you know, we got that going. Okay, guys, keeping up with the interviewing Hollywood, thank you for joining me, your host, Shahid Manning, and we will be back with the next interview.